G'day everyone and welcome back to another episode of Friday Gamer. Today, I'm taking a look at Day of the Tentacle Remastered. Uh, I don't know much about this game. Uh, well I don't know anything about this game. Uh, I just heard that it's pretty good, so I decided to check it out. Uh, at first I thought I was gonna like play the whole game, I was gonna do like a full series on it. Uh, but then I thought, you know, maybe I won't like it. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. So I'm gonna do a Friday Gamer. I'm gonna have a bit of a bash in it. If I like it enough to want to record it, I will. <clears throat> um, okay, let's go. New game. This is really cool. New game. Would you like to enable the developer's commentary? Uh, no. That That's a weird question. No. Oh boy, what? What's going on? Oh, it's a LucasArts game. LucasArts Entertainment Company. Uh, ooh, what is this? What? There's a there's a fish. There's a bird. This is beautiful. Look at this. Bump bump. Oh, pollution. Delicious. Oh, of course. Bird just died. Just died. Oh my! Whoa! What have we got here? We've got a couple of tentacles, do we? Look at these. I'm thirsty. You're thirsty. I don't think you should drink that. Yeah, you probably shouldn't drink. Keep out. It looks bad for you. Yeah, it looks bad for you. This guy, this guy, this is my kind of guy. This green guy. Feel great. Smarter. Um. More aggressive. Makes you feel smarter and aggressive. I feel like I could. Uh. Like I could. Is he gonna explode into like a million? Whoa, chicken. I think. Like I could. I think that was a bad idea. What happened? It had nice hands, tentacle. Oh, oh, it's this kind of game. It's that kind of game. Oh, the dramatic thunder. Yep. Oh, we're back in the main menu screen. <laughs> Look, Kogi, it's a hamster. It's a hamster. I need for dissection lab tomorrow. Oh, 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 you know, like we could bite its head off or whatever. Oh yeah, that's Hands great. Off that hamster. Friend of yours, <laughs> Bernard. Bernard. To weird Ed Edison. Look at these guys. This is the gang right here. Can we turn on it's subtitles? My old friend, Green Tentacle. He says that purple tentacles mutated into an insane genius. Oh. And Dr. Fred's going to kill them both. An old friend? Help? Hmm. I thought I was free of Dr. Fred and those crazy Edisons forever. But now, I know that I must go back to, to the, the future. Uh, what did he say? Go back to the invention? I missed that. I must go back to the future. What is this? That's not a DeLorean. Day of the Tentacle. Do, 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 do. What is going on with the car? There we go. That's how cars work. This is cool. It's interesting. Look at that. Programmers. UK. It's a little bit loud. But where's the car going? It's leaping over to the moon. Is that the moon? It's a bloody big moon, if you ask me. It's got that nice cartoon sort of... Well, that's a silly thing to say. Of course it's... Yeah. It's not realistic, because the ca Look, the car's going... That's not real. It just went in... No. Uh. The perspective of everything isn't quite correct. And the physics of all this, it doesn't match up to, well, life and science. Well, that's, that's a bit traumatic. You did not, you didn't really have to do that. That was a little bit. Where are you going? Who's in the car? Was, was everyone in the car? Like those three guys and the hamster? I bet you the hamster's driving this car. Oh, there's those three guys and there's like... <laughs> Ciao, amigo. Oh, oh, there's a, there's someone in the top window. That that is 
Oh, they winked at me. They winked at me, guys. Okay, we'll spread out commando style. Laverne, you commando go to the area behind those double doors. Hoagie, you take care of upstairs reconnaissance. I'll yep. maintain command HQ here in yeah. the lobby. What are we looking for? We've got to find where Dr. Fred is holding the tentacles. This better not take too long. I've got an anatomy final tomorrow. We gotta find out where Dr. Fred is keeping the oh, tentacles. No, That's shut up later tonight. That was the best I line. Don't get a test the drums. I haven't oh, touched Dr. my master Fred. keyboard in like a solid maybe five minutes. This lab. is awesome. Question is, where's his secret lab? Where is the secret lab? Oh. Day of the tentacle controls. Uh walk to confirm. Oh walk to oh yeah, it's a click, I, knew, I, knew, I know it's a click game. Uh, open Venturi, uh, open, escape, uh, select Hoagie Bernard. Wait, we can change. Is that the numpad? I don't know, my numpad on this keyboard doesn't quite work, so I'm a little bit scared of that. Or can you just use the normal numbers? I hope you can, my numpad has a tendency not to work. Skip dialogue. Oh, PlayStation controller. Wait, they don't have Xbox? Ha, <laughs> suck. No, I'm not going to say that. I'm sorry. It's just a little strange that they show a PlayStation controller on a, on a computer game. Um, I don't, I'm not interested in that because uh, I'm using mouse keyboard. So, is my mouse being recorded? Oh, it is. Good. Okay. Uh, well, I'm going to forget all of this because I usually do forget everything in game games. It's sort of how I roll. Uh, okay, let's go back. Oh, okay, let's, out of order. Let's have a look at this payphone. Hello? A door? I can't. Hello? How do I... What was the controls again? Oh, shoot. What was those controls again? Okay. Can I continue? I'll resume game. Okay. Ah, uh, ha, ha, ha. Use payphone. Look at payphone. It looks broken, but there's something in the coin return. Hold on. I'm, I'm gonna get the subtitles because that should be an option that's good let's use those subtitles something in the coin return use payphone it looks broken but there's something in the coin return how do i oh give dime pick up dime let's pick it up steal it what's this is this my inventory a textbook uh oh Op let's open the Chicago it. manual of thermodynamic oh. flux induction circuit design. Great stuff. <laughs> that was awesome. Okay. Pool dime. Excuse me. Can I use payphone? Out of order. Yeah, I can read. Uh, can we examine? Okay. Can we switch people? How do we switch people? Oh god, do you have to- is it the numpad? That's a shame. Maybe I can't. Okay, let's walk out here. Look at him. Look at this- this cheeky bugger. Open! Aha! A secret passage. Oh! This is all too easy. Oh. Oh. Was I supposed to- Oh. Okay, now it's this guy. I forgot his name. Laverne! How do you get upstairs? Am I upstairs? I got lost. See God's any sake. tentacles? <laughs> What's a tentacle? What's a tentacle? Oh, just something I whipped up in my spare time. Made good pets, actually. I, I wouldn't want a tentacle for a pet. Take over the world. I'm not you sure about tie you. Tie the little buggers up in the basement. Good thing you told us that. Yeah, Bernard wanted us to set them free. Thank God you weren't that stupid. Did you say Bernard? Huh. Oh, uh, why okay, are you sitting you're free? free to go. Wait, what? Thanks, Bernard. Yes, thank you, naive human. Now I can finish taking over the world. <laughs> why would he let? He knew. Didn't he know that oh, they were yeah. bad? Now I remember. Yeah, you He's bastard. Incredibly evil, isn't he? Good uh, job, Bernard. I'll try to talk him out of it. Because he drank all the, like, chemicals. Well, what possible harm could one insane mutant tentacle do? Uh, if it's anything like the gremlins. Sleeping lab rats! Dr. Fred, 
Where did the tentacles go? They're in a basement. Now, Purple Tentacle is free to use his evil mutant powers to take over the world and enslave all humanity. Well, isn't Oops. that a little bit dramatic? Our only hope now is to turn <laughs> off my sludge magic machine and yeah. prevent the toxic mutagen from entering the river. Isn't it yeah. a little late for that, Doctor? Of course. That's why I'll have to do well, it. Well, it was all your fault from the start, Yesterday, Doctor. Through the time machine. Wait, if you have a time machine, fault, couldn't you have done this like ages ago and the stop the tentacle from drinking? Dog, can't you just send Bernard? This is a whole conspiracy well, theory, you, you bastards. You that one of you will make it there alive. Have any oh. people ever been hurt in this thing? Of course not. Okay. This is the first time I've ever tried it on people. Okay. Well, is that a car? Like... Uh, well, I think we should have should have called like Dr. Emmett Brown. I think he this is his area of expertise. Bernard, float over here so I can punch you. <laughs> this must be that Woodstock place Mom and Dad are always talking about. Do, 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 do. What could it all mean? I don't know. What? I don't know. Uh, there's a tentacle. We may not live to see yesterday. I'm sure that makes Fred sense. wouldn't have done this if it weren't safe. He, he did After just say. He is a doctor. Yeah, but a doctor of what? what? I can't believe it. And they said imitation diamond wasn't good enough. Who said that? Uh oh. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> oh, don't tell me they're all in different times. Ye old what? Ye old what? 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 They better be in the same time, same year. I think this goes in the future. Like. Yeah. Oh. Uh, well, that's confusing. Cheap mail order jewels. What happened to Hokey and Laverne? I knew I should have bought a real diamond. Oh, you are they alive? Idiot. <laughs> My dials say that the larger specimen landed two hundred <laughs> years in the past, and the other is stuck two hundred years. I in knew the it. Future. I knew it. I knew she was in the future. Bring them back. I will! As soon as I get a new diamond, then all your buddies have to do is plug in their respective chronogons and... Plug them in? Where is Hoagie going to find an electrical outlet 200 years in the past? That's a little yes, bit... well, he'll be needing my patented super battery then, won't he? Now, where did I put those patented super battery plans of mine? Plans? How are we gonna get Hoagie plans? Don't worry, Send him another mail, thing. Boy. Just help me find the plans. They're in this house somewhere. Okay. No, uh, what blah, am blah. I going to do? Find the plans, like I the doctor think said. I made myself perfectly clear. Step one. Find here. Yeah. Find <laughs> plans. Find Step plans. Two. Save world. Step three. Get out of my house. Let's get crushed. So, yeah. Where's my mouse? Can I have my mouse? Oh, here we go. Oh. Is it? Okay. Here we go. Let's, uh, let's... Is that... Oh, it's a toilet. That makes sense. Uh, look at it's toilet. It's empty. It's empty? You probably emptied it. Uh, pick up toilet. There's nothing to get. Uh, can I use it? Oh, use toilet with... Power switch. Oh wait, whoops. I don't think I can do that. Mm, maybe that's a bad idea. Okay. Uh can I open power switch? Hello? I don't want to cause any more trouble. Why not? I don't want to pick it up. Okay, let's uh push time no machine. No way. 
No. Where's your fun? Cool time no machine. Way. Where's all your fun, you it time can't machine? Do anything without a new diamond. How about open time no machine? Way. Oh, fine, Mr. Party People. Let's go down here and uh, find the plants. We've got to find some plants. Maybe I put them upstairs. That's got to be it. Upstairs. Maybe you put them in the time machines and you sent them into the past. What is this? Hamster chair. That's, that's strange. I think it's designed to run with something. More like a small rodent. Yeah. Like a hamster. It looks like a generator driven by a treadmill. Yeah, that that, that uses a... What does this switch do? What's over here? To do. I can't... Okay. Uh, give paper. Oh. Give paper to... I don't know. Something. Can I take it? Uh, pick... I've got the plans. Oh. Quick, we have they to were the plans. How did you get over there? Yeah, how did you get over there? I just got a sky message, by the way. Hold on. My ingenious super battery design, please. You really flushed them. You just flushed them. Yes. Down the toilet. No, through time. Using the highly sophisticated time flux hydraulic vortex chamber I've installed in each chronogen, you can flush small inanimate objects to each other through time. Through time, but it needs power. Flush small inanimate objects to each other through time. Hello. Did she hear that? Doctor Fred, can you hear me? Drat. Did you hear something? No. Let's see uh, if what's his name catches on. So wait, can they speak through it now? Oh great, I'm stuck in colonial times. Tentacles are taking over the world, <laughs> and now the toilet's backing up. Okay, come over here. It's your old pal, Doctor Fred. Doctor Fred, how'd you get in there? Uh. I want you to pick up those plans you see in the chronogen, Hoagie. Bring them to Red Edison. He's my great, 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 great grandfather. He'll know what to do. You need the plans to make a super battery so you can plug in your chronogen. Okay, if you say but so, Bernard. This is the conspi- Good boy. Does he have any experience? This is the paradox. Um, well, I once saw him take 3,000 volts directly through his head without batting an eye. Didn't he pass out? Well, he was already passed out when it happened. Ugh. <laughs> Time for me to save the world, I guess. I guess. Isn't this a bit of a paradox? Because he's going to speak to the, the doctor's great, 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 maybe another few more greats. Grandfather. And then doesn't that mean he's gonna mess with the past and then maybe the doctor would never get never be born? I mean this is like this is some back to the future stuff right here. I mean, you can't tell me that oh this game probably came out before the back to the future stuff, like before the time travel business. Uh no it didn't. It came out in like nineteen ninety three or in the nineteen nineties, and Back to the Future came out in nineteen eighty five and nineteen eighty Nine was the last one, I think. So you can't say that this game doesn't know about time travel. It. What do you mean you can't move it? Oh god. Those founding fathers are driving me nuts. Flag design changes every five minutes. Well, as soon as I'm done with this, I'm making them a flag ready or uh, not. Hello. Do, 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 do. Use carriage. I don't think it's usable. Making it dirtier won't help. Well, why not? It's totally covered with crud. <laughs> I like this guy. This guy's cool. Let's uh, let's have a look. Looky. Ooh, mailbox. Push mailbox. Oh, Jesus! Woohoo! The Pony Express. <laughs> what? Jeez, what is that? Ooh, the Pony Express. Is it something shooting out of the mailbox? 
I, I don't even know. Is it Ooh, something running across? Pony Express. Will you shut up with the Pony Express? I get it. Open mailbox. Oh, is it something? Uh, look at letter. You're brilliant. What a novel design. Come to Baltimore at once. I don't know where that is. I don't know what that is. So that means nothing to me. Let's close it. Okay. Shall we go up into the door? Let's save the world, shall we? It's time to save the world. Push door. We're going to mess with the past. This isn't used. I don't want to. You don't want to use the door? I can't even go in it. Come on. Knock on it. I can't. I can't use the door. This is a little bit strange if you ask me. Can I use the carriage with the note, with the letter? Making it dirty no. won't help. Okay, let's go up here. Let's go for a bit of a walk around. We need we need some answers. We need answers. Can I go this way? Oh look I can. Whoa. Perspective Oh. Ben Franklin. Ben Franklin! Let's talk to him. Let's ruin his past. There, ruin his future, I should Franklin. say. Ben Franklin! Soon to be known as the inventor of electricity! Okay. Uh, do you know Red Edison? He's a scientist guy, too. Red Edison? A scientist? He's just an innkeeper who pretends to be a scientist, and he's not very good at doing either one. Yeah. I can't believe what If this guy's soon the his in of all places to write our constitution. If this guy's gonna be oh cool, finally. Some okay. Shouldn't you say the discoverer of electricity? Uh huh. Yeah. Let's do Shouldn't that. you say the discoverer of electricity? Yeah, he's not you inventing think it. The ultimate power in the universe is just under some rock waiting to be discovered? Yes. Huh. It I, is. Ben Franklin, I'm going to summon power from the sky by sheer force of genius. I don't. Nah, uh, I wonder what Red would say about that. I think this guy is the idiot scientist. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use this one. Screw I could it. use a little power myself for my time machine. There will be power enough for all in time. There aren't any time machines yet anyway. <laughs> That's next summer's project. <laughs> this guy's an idiot. Whacked. You are truly whacked, Ben. Yeah, people say that to me too. I'm truly whacked. <laughs> Wasn't that you? Good point. Guess they were right. Um I wonder what Red would say about that. Who cares about that crackpot? Uh Where is so, he? So, where's this red guy at? Down in his secret lab, of course, neglecting his secret dad. lab. Fantastic. Uh so what's so bad about Red? Aren't you the hundred dollar guy? Aren't you the hundred dollar guy? Hmm, the hundred dollar guy, not bad. <laughs> um, what's so bad about Red? What can you say about a guy who spent the last four years perfecting a left handed hammer? He's insane. What? And he steals other people's inventions, too. I'm sure they can he does. Apply for the patent. I'm sure. Not that I'm bitter. Uh, save humanity. Oh, I need Red to help me save humanity. So he's a missionary now, eh? Well, why not? Can't be any worse at that than he is at inventing. Well, see ya. Carry on. Okay. Okay, this is fun. I'm enjoying this game. Do 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 do. So he's in his secret lair, which is in this house, maybe. Can I go in now? Oh, now I can go in. Oh, well, would you look at that? Let's go through this door. Open door. Hello? Oh, John. John, 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 John. Let's talk to him. It's okay, John. Speak Yo. to me. Hello? 
What's up, you cold? What's up, you cold? Cold? I'm freezing. <laughs> uh, well, why don't you put a coat on? I'm wearing a coat, you nitwit. I yeah, you nitwit. I got this blanket, which makes me itch, and I'm still freezing. Maybe you should make a fire. Why don't you build a fire? Well, I keep asking Jefferson to build a fire, but he won't. Says he needs the log for posterity and won't part with it. Well, why is he so cold? He's going to give the logs to starving children. You mean it's like a symbol of growth or something? You mean it's like a symbol of growth or something? I don't get any respect around here. No. Why? I bet it's George. I spent the winter in Valley Forge. Washington was cold. We'd get some heat in here. Well, I gotta go, dude. Oh, no. Awesome, awesome blanket. blanket there, dude. <laughs> Thank you. Aren't they confused, like, I mean, shocked with what he's wearing? It's like, hey, where'd you get that hat, dude? Where'd you get that shirt, dude? Wait, this, yeah. Um. <laughs> How come you sign your name so big? Astigmatism. Why are you guys in here? What are you guys doing in here? We're writing a... a uh... A, 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 writing the... We're drafting a constitution for the United States. Okay. Don't say draft. You'll only make me colder. <laughs> Wim. Whoop, you bastard. Why don't you have some hot Why coffee? Don't you have some hot coffee. Oh, I can't stand coffee. Oh, well. It makes me irritable and want to bang my head against the walls. Um, I can relate. Oh, I can relate. <laughs> well, please don't do it around here. Okay. I gotta go. Well, I gotta go, dude. That's, uh... If I had a nickel for every time I've seen that face... What? How much would you have? Let's, uh, open the suggestion box. It's padlock. Oh, damn. The Constitutional Convention invites your comments, critiques... No. Amendments to the Constitution. Smoke detector? How does that work? It's a little cage with a canary in it, perched above a little lever. Huh. Hmm. Let's uh, open the door. Let's go in. No, whoa. Someone doesn't want me in there. Can I uh, push? How about if I pull it? <laughs> let's, uh, let's go out. These guys are just busy in there. Ooh, a mummy. Talk to mummy. What's Hello. Up? What's up, dude? Don't feel just like chillin'. talking, huh? Vow of silence or something, probably right. <laughs> Does well, that's it... cool. Does he have it actually? Is... What? Great hat, man. Great hat, man. <laughs> He's having a conversation Wait, with the dude. with the freaking mummy. Uh, let's go down here. Oh, is this a? It's a grandfather clock. I'm guessing it conceals the entrance to a secret lab. What? It's the same lab. It's the same lab. Why can't I go in it? I'm guessing it conceals the entrance to a secret lab. Uh, go in it then. I'm guessing it conceals the, the entrance. The doctor's to a in there. The doctor man's in there. Oh well. Let's have a look up upstairs. What's in this door? Open the door. Hello. Not much in here. Let's pull the cord. Oh. Yeah, I am. Don't get your curls in an uproar. Oh. Excuse me, Mr. Washington. Okay, let's uh, let's not, maybe not go in there. Oh, have a, maybe have a look in the car. That's not what I'd call a lot of cleaning supplies. <laughs> no way, I'd be busted for sure. Busted for sure. 
<laughs> it's like in a world where men get. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna say that. I told oh, you guys hello. I'll get to the flag next. I'm working as fast as I can. It's fine. Do hey, you know where chill. Red is? Take your time. Don't tell me you've got another design change for the flag. Do these the American flags? <laughs> I've got another design change for the flag. I knew it. What's the current brainstorm from our fickle founding fathers? <laughs> uh. Let's use the rubber one. Have a chrome-plated bald eagle robot on it. Oh, what the heck. At this point, I'd do anything just to have it over with. Oh, she's seriously going to do that? On the table, and I'll look at it when I'm done with this job. Yes, please. Let's put the pattern on the table. Stars and stripes. Dull, dull. Oh, that's the current. That's the hey, current don't flag. don't criticize design. unless you got a better idea. I told you, robots. Gosh, I'd never want to mess with history. Please mess with history. Gosh, I'd never want to mess with history. I don't want to. How do you know about messing with history? Have you seen Back to the Future? What's in this door? Greetings from the other side. No, 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 don't go out. Let's take it. Hells yeah. What's 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 going on here? Look at me. Hey, what's that on the plan? It looks like a secret backwards message. What? Oh, it's just a coffee stain. Ah. Oh, I'd only mess it up. Oh, fine. What's in here? Open it. Brody, man. I don't no. go through people's underwear. Ben's bed. It, no, this is Ben's nah, bed. Ah, there's printer's ink on the sheets. Okay, uh, should we keep going down the hallway? We need to find the red guy, the doctor, the idiot doctor, apparently. Let's talk to the horse. Uh, hi, horsey. Hi. Oh, hi yourself. Now, you can talk. Uh. Wow, you can talk. Wow, so can you. What a coincidence. <laughs> well, wow, you can talk. What's a horse What's like a you nice doing horse in here? What's a horse like you doing in a place like this? Hey, I live here. What are you doing here? Hey, what am I doing here? I'm trying to get back to the future and save the world. I did. I didn't think horses could talk. Is this some kind of trick? I'm save the world. Back to the future and save the world. Let's just tell the truth. The future, huh? And I thought that Franklin guy was off his nut. Hey, I'm not off my nut. I'm on my nut. I didn't think horses could talk. Is this some kind of trick? Is this some kind of a trick? Yes. I don't do magic. I'm just a horse. Are you sure, man? That nice teeth. Nice teeth. Thanks. Thanks. I knew you was gonna say that. I paid Poor. quite a bit for them. They gold teeth. I didn't think horses could talk. Yeah, that's a bit strange, Maybe isn't it? I just never had anything to say to you. Ever think of that? You uh -huh. mean horses have been snubbing me my whole life? Well, if you want to put it that way. This is strange. Well, is that a glass of I milk? Gotta go. See you later. See you later. Yep. Let's get. So, what's in here? Is this gonna be a secret lair? Oh. Uh. Question is, which one's stuffed and which one's the real McCoy? I don't know. I assure you that we are both real, but we are neither one of us McCoys. We are Edison's, Ned and Jed. Who's who? Does it really matter? Yes. Duh. What is Even wrong our with dear the father voices? Even can't tell us apart. He only knows that one of us is left-handed while the other is right, but that neither of us are following in his tiny scientific footsteps. Why would they want to follow in tiny scientific footsteps? Hold still, Jed. So, I'm almost too frightened to ask. Are you the marble delivery man? Or the model. Huh. I'm the model. Should I take my clothes off <laughs> now? No. No, you most definitely should not. 
We couldn't get your body shape right anyway, unless we cemented two slabs of marble together. But then your statue would have a big seam in it. No, oh, that's a shame. That's okay. It would have one anyway. Look, don't call us. We'll call you. Dang. Uh. Sorry, hope I haven't jostled you. Too late. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna I'm go ahead and wrap this episode up of Friday Gamer. I'm enjoying this game. I'm gonna play this game no matter what, but if you want me to record it, let me know. If I get any sort of, any request to record it, uh, I will. But if I don't, I might just play it in my free time. Uh, so yeah. If you enjoyed this video of Day of the Tentacle Remastered, I like this game. I didn't play the original, and then when the remastered came out, it's like, oh, that game looks that game looks alright. Then I heard some good things about it, so I got it, and now I'm play and now I've played it, and it's good. So far, uh, I wonder if we're gonna save the world from the tentacles. <laughs> anyway, if you enjoyed this, leave a like, subscribe, and stuff, and we'll see you in the next video, which would be. Uh, whenever. So yeah, thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye!